like, subscribe, hit the bell. I got a rack, I got a bag, keep it a stack. Get rid of lands and kiss that attack. Army on me, while we chase in the bag. Catch in the L, then we run in the bag. I always move forward, I never fall back. Niggas want more than I know, this one crack. Up in the field, now we lit off of that. Hey, I'm the sense that we smoke with the clan. So hurt the buff, we won't smoke with the hands. Niggas want more, so I bring Caliban. Blood of that nigga, it's see through his pants. But let's see, y'all can now, I copped it in friends. He can catch when I take the advance. Moving so pretty, they stuck in a trance. I'm rocking the case, see the drip in my stance. Hey, I'm the sense that don't fuck with the clan. I heard the pop, we won't smoke with the hands. Two princes on me, I fuck if I can. Do we hop in the coast, watch the money expand? Who's got the sense that don't fuck with the clan? I heard the pop, we won't smoke with the hands. Two princes on me, I fuck if I can. Do we hop in the coast, watch the money expand? I got a plan, ay, ice strip in my hands, ay, yeah. I got a plan, ay, ice strip in my hands, ay, yeah. I got a plan, ay, these niggas don't wanna throw hands, ay, yeah. I got a plan, ay, machine, we throwin' the lands, ay, yeah. I got a plan, ay, ice strip in my hands, ay, yeah. I got a plan, ay, ice strip my fans, hey, yeah. I got a plan, hey, these niggas don't wanna throw hands, hey, yeah. I got a plan, like machine, we throw in the lands, hey, yeah. <laughs> you guys think white is safe? <laughs> oh man, I pity the fool. <laughs> that nigga dying. <laughs> white not seeing the end of this arc. <laughs> he running into the certified. He he running into the goat as a certified bam lover. I'm letting y'all know. Prepare your butts for irregular shenanigans. How y'all doing, man? We got a plan here. I'm all right. White about to get off. You praying for me? It's right. We got the coffin ready. What's up? I don't support it, but white not looking too good right now. Let me grieve. White must have booked his coffin early. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I just, this is just so funny though because it's like the opposite where I'm like, no, guys, you guys are doing too much. Bam's not going to win. And now I, I've been proven wrong so many times. I'm just like, yo. I know, I know what this man does when he gets into fights. He about to get the W. I got no, I got no doubt. There's no doubt in my heart. All right, let's let's let's, let's hop in though. Five hundred four. Last week, I just remember laughing. It was a it was a lesson on the stock market, and capitalism, and Iraq was throwing racks. That's what I remember. <laughs> so yeah, CBL. I already know. You already know. What's up, Pat? All right, the jump will begin. 10 seconds. And if my if my camera freezes, tell me. <laughs> Look at Bam sitting there. He waiting. He's coming. Nine. He's coming. Tails used a story about slave in utero tower of God. 52nd floor. A dark twist. Zero six. Why do I remember? Is that, is that, was it always called that? A dark twist? Wasn't it like a dark change? Am I tripping? Oh, anyways. One turn earlier. Calavan's field. Trust. Oh, shit. Calavan. In front of the finish line. What's this? Oh, he's done? <laughs> you already... Yo, you finished that shit? <laughs> That's the goat. That's a jump pad. How do you use it? 
The requirement to jump is simple, Calavan. One more helper should come to your field. Wow. They gave him one of those ones. So what? So what, basically, if no, if no one comes to help him, he's got to stand there? That's crazy. I already read this chapter, short as fuck. Oh, really? The other translation? Yeah, okay. I, okay, all right. Fair enough. A chat, dark change. Caliban finessed early. He said, he said, make, make, pink, pink, pink essence of bravery. I'm here. You you can't come, though. Why not? You need a friend. Come on, dog. <laughs> That's, I'll be pissed if I was him, bro. All right, so, if one, if, if one more of your teammates comes to the battlefield, you'll be able to jump and reach the finish line. I see. That's not a very easy requirement for me to read right now. I have underestimated this because a lot of his his core got blown up. But Chian he was alive, did you see? With all due respect, if you just reach the finish line, you can go straight to where Liborc is. Abdel, my guy. My brother. I appreciate the sub, man. That scared the hell out of me, bro. I'm like, what's happening in my ear? I forgot that I had those on. I appreciate it. But if you just uh, reach the finish line, you can go straight to where Liborc is. Although fighting him when you get there is a violation of military law, of course. Don't be concerned. I'm I'm not after treason, just his neck. What does that mean? What? Wait, hold on. That just make, that just makes sense. That, that trans, that's that's got to be translation error. You're not allowed to fight him. You're a grunt. You are you are attacking a superior officer. I just want his neck. His neck is you, what? It's fighting him. You gonna kill him? What, the, what, what? What's happened? What just happened? Did that? Did that not just? Did, anyways, you know what? That didn't make any sense. That's all I'm saying. That's crazy. Line release. Line squadron built different. What's up, Ace? Isn't this, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Isn't it the same thing? Like, I'm confused. That's a weird ass line, but I'm gonna let it go. Batman Calvin said, I'm not betraying the army. I'm just gonna kill this one nigga. Like, <sighs> all right, man. You got it, dude. Um, don't be concerned. I'm not after treason, just his neck. Then the teammate I could expect, meow. I guess his, I guess only is. Division Commander Chiang Hiha, who is headed for the Cat Tower. I'll just have to look forward to her. She's certainly capable of making her way here. So we'll meet on the other side soon. Liboric. That's cold. <laughs> he, he's like... I, I hope he could like reform his arm at some point, man. I don't know. The the, the ethereal bref a uh, preference preference. What was that? what word was I just about? To, what word was I just about to say? Preference. Anyways, the essence of bravery ethereal arm is cool, but I want his arm back. That's crazy. It's fall. It's fall break, so I've been relaxing. That's good. I'm actually like technically like I'm just I'm just off right now, so. <laughs> How disappointing. Former Commander Corps, Cal uh, Commander Calavan, for someone of that position to betray the army just because he lost a few troops and lost sight of the greater cause. Everything is under our great man's will. Is that, that the king? Great man's? Why do you say it like that? I don't, I don't know why. I don't, I don't like that. So I'll say that again. <laughs> don't, you can't change anything even if you make it here. You just sit in there. I think Liborc is low-key kind of cold. I'm not going to lie to you. I think he's kind of cold, low-key. But I'm, I'm a Calavan stand. I can't lie to y'all. I fuck with that nigga. We're nothing in... We're, not, we're, we're just nothing in comparison. This kind of ties back to Arya talking about the the look of inf inferiority. So maybe he just thinks no matter what, he's just a pawn in this greater fate and game and blah, blah, blah. And he's by the portal, I think, right? Yep. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. The jump will begin in 10 seconds. There's Bam sitting. Ten, nine, he's coming. Eight, well, nine, eight, hey, seven, six, five. It's too late to stop him now, damn it. Four, three, two, the jump begins. Here's Johnny. <laughs> okay, here's White. Why power? He's coming through. The, okay, oh my god, I saw you, I get it. He's teleporting like shit. Show my, show my nigga, like damn. It took so long. Oh, there he is. Yes, sir. You about to get packed. <laughs> I can't. I can't. All I'm, all, all, all I'm going to say is this. If he go down, 
Because I know how many people like white. I just want to hear what everyone's excuse is. I'm not even... I, I have a new gimmick that I learned from Vince. I'm not, I'm not even going to comment. I'm going to just ask you guys to explain what happened to me. That's what I'm, that's what I'm going to do. It's because... <laughs> Anyways, he's got to be cold. I said, yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. With with, with that double, with the double um, family bloodline too. If that boy folds my caliber, I'm gonna be laughing my ass off. I'm the, I'm the one you know as the great man, <laughs> somewhat different from other humans type. Beat. He probably got pulled with a Dory or Jahaj. Would think he might be killing my Borg. Hmm. You need to give us. A, you need to give us a set of rules for Jahad army if their own people are trying to arrange for like this. Like. I could understand maybe some acceptance being made, but it's, I know Calavan and Dory have a good relationship, so maybe she can like wipe it under the rug and change the story. But like he is directly going against what they're trying to do. It, it was, is his plan to take like, like take kill like Mark and not take his spot and try to capture Bam and shit? Like I don't know, man. It just it just it's just so kind of a weird situation. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Avenge, if you want to hop in, I don't know if you're busy. You, you can hop in after when I'm done reading the chapter. If you want to hop in, but. All right, so Bam's walking towards him. Where there's White, as expected, you were waiting for me. Some boss level shit. It's only although it's only been ten minutes. Wasn't it enough time to change? Is there anything you'd like to know, like how your teammates who are how your teammates who are with me are doing? I have no words to say to a devil. And then White takes his sword out. Bam, kind of flexes his palm. And he, oh, he ignited, he ignited his thorn. He shot something out. I'm not gonna lie to you. Sometimes I don't know if anyone, I don't, I don't know if anyone else feels this way. I think SIU has gone some at, at times on occasion. He goes a little overboard with the like, the effects, and it's, a, it's sometimes it's hard to tell what's happening. I know that he's slashing. I know that Bam's using his technique, but it's like sometimes he, the lines don't have a. Unintended, uh, like, like, like the sequence of or the order of which the events are happening is hard to tell. Like, one thing I always give Toriyama a lot of credit for is no matter what's happening in the action panel, you can actually tell for the most part what's happening first. Like, if Vegeta punches, then Goku dodges and counters with a kick, like, you could tell with the way it's moving that it's, it's the punch, dodge, ki like, punch, duck, kick. Like, I just know shit's happening, but it's just, I don't know. Sometimes he goes crazy with the effects and it looks pretty, but like. It's it's more flair than it is substance, but it's it's, it's a nice panel though. White swinging that sword, baby. Ah, look at screaming with his two little fingers and <laughs> finger claw attack. Better spirits. That's a weird line, man. But he's in better spirits or better. So yeah, like a white slash is like through all of that. That's kind of see. That's clean. That's that's a clean slash. That's clean. Uh, looks like he's like splitting the sea almost. There comes Bam through with his palm up. Our bad relationship will end once and for all. That's <laughs> why did he say that? That's not intimidating, bro. <laughs> How satisfactory. The fiery look towards me is about to explode. Watch Bam take his soul. Yep. I never seen a person so excited for his own funeral. I know. Hey man, I got a fresh cut. I feel like a holy nigga. Oh shit. You, hey man, just stay away from my girl, bro. Don't don't look at don't look in her direction, you demon. I don't even think SC could explain it at this point. I think Calvin kid like Bark is gonna go after Bam. Okay, I would love that, but Bam beating him too. Facts, start a choice, Bam. Facts, <laughs> you get it. Boy, oh, Bam is packing that nigga Calvin too. He he not he not he not safe. Bring a family head. All right. Then I'll then I'll be concerned. Essence of murder. S O you gonna go for anime feel and the manga panel flow? Yeah. Why think you Moses on these transitions are so bad like that? Like better spirits. It's about to explode. That hatred. What hatred, man? Captain. Bang, bang, bang. Is it that lightning power again? Bam's wings are out. I see the thorns. This hurts even me. Ah. Sorry, he's, I don't know why I, I, I screamed it like that. He, Palm strikes the sword. Is he? Oh, I had a feel. I had a feeling he did that. He stopped my sword. Then he comes in with the knee. But uh, what did what did White do? Did he dodge it? Did he like? It almost looks like he like brought his shoulder into like dodge it. I don't know. That's I don't know. I can't even. I I kind of can't tell what's happening. I'm not gonna lie to you, but that looked cool though. 
And Bam is like flipping around, I think. Yeah, okay. And White got his guard up. So he had like a, like a flip kick. Yeah, 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 okay. He did the, the Tanjiro water wheel, whatever, you know, breathing shit. And White swings through it. Bam's like, is he, is he surprised? Yeah, he's trying to step back on it. Yep, yeah, yeah, he caught him off guard. Ugh! He kind of blocks it, though. Have you, you haven't forgotten that my royal sword can strike you from any angle, have you? You are the one who should remember. That mine does this, this mine does too. There's like an orb behind it that's twinkling that White didn't see. An orb. Since when did it come? Crash. Oh, that's, oh shit, we're done. Okay, that's the end of the chapter. So he caught him off guard with the orb. So while White was like boasting about his attack starting from any angle, I guess Bam also hit like an orb around. It kind of reminds me a little bit of what he did against Dada Jihad. All right. Bram practiced his lines for when he confronts Rachel again. <laughs> Our bad relationship ends here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're right. This was way shorter than I thought it was. Ah. White brought his other hand to block the knee. Oh, okay, okay, okay. The chapter was longer in the Raws. Was it really now? Short chapter, short chapter. Yeah, I don't know. Um, what what can I what can I really sink my teeth into here? Like the libor the Calavan stuff is interesting. So I guess like to some degree, the f each field takes into account the personality and the position that the that the player is in. So at Bam, it's like maybe he did, they, they thought he wouldn't want to kill other endangered species like like when he's fighting like the ewok the ewok looking niggas or whatever um i guess with calavan he's kind of like a lone wolf you know just like a soldier doing three type thing so it's like if the, the the challenge for you is that let's see if anyone cares enough to come and help you i suppose um with yamma maybe because he's kind of straightforward and not very intelligent he's just like just a straight battle gauntlet but which which yes ratchet would hide himself in one of the basic cages to catch him off guard so yeah um van kill i don't know yet so we'll have to see with her liborg's lines are consistent with arias talking about his uh inferiority complex and things of that nature when she was wondering why does white have that look too so maybe he's thinking he's like a pawn or something i don't know what calvin plans on doing here i think i think a cool thing to happen with this is that Caliban, no matter what happens, ends up like a almost a fugitive, and has to like chase Bam on like 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 he's a rogue. Uh, Bam sounds like a white high school kid. <laughs> Bam versus Live Borg is looking to be interesting. Yeah, actually, I think I think I think now I'm a little more intrigued into it to see how it goes. So as we as we deliver, as Caliban got trolled, perhaps. Um, what's up, Lamb? What's up, my guy? What it do? But yeah, like, I'm I'm just I'm just so interested to see what's gonna happen because Bam, Bam already looked good to me, fighting like White's supposed to be a legendary slayer, a legendary character. Even if Bam has a very good showcase against him, that says a lot to how strong he really is. I might I'm I'm starting to think I might have downplayed him in my I did a power ranking video for Bam, and I basically said he's like advanced ranker level, but if he burns all of his powers and all of his abilities and for the short time that he can stay in all those modes, I said he's high ranker. But he's probably like, I don't know, I, I, I now, now I have to say top 500 maybe, or 500-ish. Before, I was thinking like maybe like lower high ranker in the thousands, 900, but look man. I care about everything that's not BAM. I mean, BAM gang, 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 yeah. Certified BAM lovers, we in here, we in here. You know, come on now, come on now. Where's Mule Love at? Where is Mule Love? I need see. I need Mule Love in Karaka, okay? It's just, just feed me. That's all I ask. I don't, I'm not, at this point, I'm not asking for much. Hound gang? <laughs> Hound board gang. You already know. You already know, exactly. Chicken Love Club. Where? Where is my guy at? That's what I'm here for. Who are you fighting? Let him fight Fusil. Let him take down the number two. No, I'm kidding. I know thing is there. Kraka, Kraka, actually Kraka and Don are fighting him. I think. Kraka, like, I'm hang, I'm, I'm hanging in there for Kraka. I'm doing my best, but I, I don't, I don't know about that guy. <clears throat> Your love busy eating chicken. <laughs> he on the battlefield. No time for this. No time for the consumption of chicken, man. Take his butt. Where 
where it needs to be. Yeah, so we'll see what happens with Calavan. I wonder if Calavan, if Calavan and White both don't make it out this arc. That'd be crazy, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Need to see Yuri on, on a Jolene gimmick. Adore gonna fall in love with Bam. Yeah, I, I've been saying that for a long time. I knew that. I haven't watched a Red TOG, but even I'm a certified Bam lover. Let's go. I mean, Karaka. If we we don't know if Karaka is male or female, do we? Technically, no, but I'm pretty sure that uh, um, always bet on Bam. <laughs> That's who I call it. Hates. What did they say about Kaido? Always bet on Kaido. Always bet on Bam. You gonna win. You gonna win, man. Dustin was right. I'm not. I just. I just. I'm not doubting him again. It's like when you watch certain players. Like it comes to a point where it's like you. You really gonna sit there and doubt a Kobe Bryant, doubt a Michael Jordan, and doubt like a LeBron? Like nah, bro. I believe you. All right, I'm not doubting them. They lose, they lose. But until I see it, I don't believe it. So, yeah, it's tough. The Bam stands were right all along. They were, they were, they were. They were right. But it's just funny because I see a lot of them fighting against this. No, he obviously isn't gonna beat White. SIU is gonna display the gap and blah blah. blah. And I'm like, are you guys sure about that? You know how many times I've thought I thought Charlie was gonna pack pack Bam in the last station when he hit him with white noise. Yuri said, "Yo, here's a black march." He took that, ignited it, and in the blog post, SAU was say, saying one swing from his attack would have killed a ranker. And I'm like, "Bro, what?" So, LaBam James, exactly, LaBam James. Uh, what does Joey say? That boy, LaBam James. This is, this is this is during the time that there was that uh. It was, it was like a like a like a reptile or like a a unicycle or something. It was like that boy. I don't know if you guys, I don't know if you guys were around for that for those memes. But yeah, the man stands right along with man James. Can we get White back to full power, please? He he is isn't he is he isn't he isn't he at full power? He's supposed to be at full power, bro. So Kobe Pam, right? <laughs> White is at full power, man. Um, he's got the souls to burn. He was able. He's able to create his swords. Um. He's, he's, he's fused with the last clone and everything. Like, from my understanding, he's at full power. I don't know if he's... Could get any... I, like, the idea is that he's trying to take Bam's soul to get to the next level. I think he believes that in a regular soul, if he if he eats that, it's, it's finally going to give him the capabilities to battle his dad, who's in a regular Arie Han, so... And speaking on the Arie Han thing, let's talk about that briefly. The R.A. Han and White thing is something that we all want to see, but that I don't think I don't think SIU necessarily cares about that. I think that's something that's a community uh, fabricated belief and want and expectation. SIU might not give a damn about any of that. He might not care to see White see his dad again. We care about that. White might go down, and and that's the last we see of him. So don't be surprised. I don't think. It's, it kind of reminds me of the Princess War thing. Like, we want it, we talk about it, but it's like, it hasn't really properly been officially stated to happen. And SIU has changed his mind on many things that he um, initially planned and made. So, um, Kobe Bam, right? Frog Gang, might need to make a comeback later. I will, I will see. He is at full power. He just chose the wrong fight. That's a fact. With the respect after this arc, honestly, I have no, I have no clue because this arc to me, this kind of feel, I don't like. My only problem with this arc is because Fug didn't seem to be too concerned about Ha Jin Sung being captured. I'm like, why should I care? There's certain things that happen in stories where I'm like, if the characters and it seems the author themselves don't care, why should I? This is kind of this is like 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 not to not to go into it, not to roast him again, but to go into like the Jack stuff with like in One Piece, like. Would you not? Would you not agree that the entire story and narrative and author were not showing the character any respect, and that includes the characters in the story, like his support, not support, his superiors, like King, like uh, King and Queen. So it's like it's hard for me to gain, garner any respect for you if the story itself is not doing that. So that's kind of how I feel about it. But the the save Hajin Thung say I like Hajin Thung. I think you should save him. I thought he was mighty important. When they got captured, they was like, oh well. Feels like we're like forcing our resources to go get him because I guess Bam or or Karak and Karaka care. So, <sighs> what I would like to see after this arc maybe is some Yuri stuff. Like what's going on with Yuri Jihad? Um, 
I, I don't have, I have no problem switching to t, uh, to Team Sweet and Sour. Where's Ran? And that kind of see so many things I like to see, but like it's also come to a point where Bam is doing Bam is so strong and doing these things with these higher rankers and high level combatants. It's like, do if these guys are still on their regular level and they're like we're gonna play a test and see rank regulars. It's like ah, it's cooked. I don't even know if I care no more. So we will see. RDA best father the best. The best. I don't think he's full power until he's back to having the million souls he had before the, before he was beaten. That's hard to say because what I would say with that is maybe it gives him like a really large supply of souls to burn. But on this field, as he was killing people, he was getting souls to burn and couldn't hit it with the that fish fight fish thing a little bit too. I think he's at full power, bro. I think it, I think we're just trying to make excuses like, bro, he's just gonna beat Bam. It is what it, Bam's just gonna beat him. I don't think that uh. I don't think he's in a full power. Still haven't given up for the Princess War. We'll see. Should I say goodbye to the Arya family story? I, I mean, we'll get the Bam variant where Bam is like on his Uret gimmick up there probably battling with him. But if you had hopes for White to be the one, I don't think so. I I have like a, a, a really bad want. Like I would love for that to be Hatsu. Like he gets that good, but it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. So yeah. Good luck. I've lost faith. Oda been doing that for years. I'm oh, God. Why did people even hear Bam would have done this mission so long? <laughs> FUD's attitude towards Hot uh, uh towards. Oh, wait. FUD's attitude towards Jinsung is SLU's attitude towards a character that are not Bam. Facts. We saw he had the souls when Bam used them when they first fought Sad Hours. Yeah, they're, they're only partial souls, and because the princess interrupted the souls, bonded with one of White's clones. White even said in the back of the hell trade that he actually devoured the souls, he'd be the greatest slayer. But you but well, white be capping. So Oda is also is also better at bringing back and handling side characters. I agree with that much to, to a certain degree. Sometimes I think he forces it, but <clears throat> and it's never jarring to me when a, when a character kind of reappears. I always think it makes sense in one piece, but we're not here for that today. But S but um SIU, Oda, and a lot of other mangaka I think as the as the cast starts to just get too big, I I don't think I don't think they're good at balancing it. I think sometimes you have to understand I think what they have to do sometimes is you have to understand what's the excess fat and cut it off. I'm sorry. I like if if he really doesn't have some important integral story to tell with characters like a Boro or Masang, get rid of them. They're just fucking excess fat. Get cut them out the story. Let them go on the floor and live their life. And when big events happen, have them like, oh, cool, bam, fug. Like you just do that. Like we have too much characters here that don't fucking matter. And then the ones that we actually care about are not doing nothing. Anak, Ran. Elaine, so many characters with so much potential and so much rich, a uh, rich history that are not doing nothing. They just watch the watch Bam do shit the show. So, yeah, yeah, it's Curry Gum supremacy, Kabara gang. We out here for real, for real. Curry Gum doesn't. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? Free Kabara, man. So yeah. But this chapter was like it was alright. It was whatever. It was short to, to the point. Caliban was doing his thing. Lab work was sitting there talking. Arya. Bam versus White. I thought White was gonna be the X Factor in this war, stuff like this, but I didn't. I don't know. I just, I didn't think he's gonna go straight for Bam like that. But hey, I have to say that Yas Ratra and White have been like the saving grace to some degree of these two things. But I'm just, I'm. You know what though? If White goes down, I win. Kind of like, <laughs> hold on, Yama gets packed. <laughs> White dead. Karaka out here with his many ways plan. Hold on, is that I went by default? <laughs> by default, even though he not doing nothing, just by the fact he not getting packed, I might just win as the last man standing. Hold on, <laughs> we team Karaka again. That's the best slayer right now. That's the best slayer. <laughs> oh shoot, he was the X Factor, just not what we thought. It's fact, we don't care about her. Pat is Yo Yo alive? Listen, that that's cooked, bro. That's cooked. I'll, at least I'll say White tried to spice up the arc as as a whole. The narrative is against him. That's a, I, I'll get. I, I'm I'm with you on that. You know what that reminds me of? For anyone who who's read who has who's like likes Death Note. Oh, spoiler! If you've never seen Death Note, uh, um, Mellow. Like you know, Mellow just 
comes after what happens and he just moves the story forward but it's like bro you are, you're not that guy pal it wasn't meant to be you it was meant to be near yeah the, the story's against you like yeah when he took things sister so yeah that's funny no one cares about that. Oh man, at least I was uh, what, gonna become Bam's friend. Yeah, when Bam, when Bam like eventually like <laughs> does whatever. Nah, I don't even, actually, I, nah, he dying. She got captured like sixty chapters ago. I'd never seen her again. Another fallen, another fallen for Curry Gum's net. Hey, when Yama gonna go super doggy in too? <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm done with the Yama stuff for the, for the most part. I'm a, I like Yas Ratchet more. I got him hooked. He doubted me too. Congrats. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, I'll, I just need all my friends to read Kubera so we can get these Kubera discussions going too, man. We need to get those going. Those are those will be elite. Those will be elite. Yeah, I just have like a seven out of ten for me. So yeah, the yeah the reading needs to happen. Nah, no white, no friendship BS. There won't be no there will, there will, there'll be no friendship because white will no longer exist. <laughs> It's not gonna become like you know, the Karaka and Bam butt buddy show where Bam is the leader and, and uh Karaka the subordinate, but we'll we'll uh <laughs> No, White White's dying, bro. And if he fights Calvin after two, Calvin dying, bro. But I always thought Calvin was in danger himself when when when, when Bam pulled up on him and stole I'm like I know what I'm supposed to think, but Especially when he had his hand behind his back too. I'm like, here we go with this handicap, you know. So, it's, in hindsight, it's kind of funny that he uh, he like had a hand behind his back and now he's missing a hand. I didn't even think about that. I don't know. That's that's just I don't know. Small detail. Small detail. It's like a five. <laughs> I got Caliban, man. I'm gonna give I'm gonna give him points for Caliban. It's actually hilarious how SC just completely abandoned making the Slayer's hype. Yeah, he gonna. Uh, gonna exist in Bam's stomach <laughs> if White dies that's a waste to be honest I wonder how FUD will react to Slayer dying by the hands of a nominee White's the true underdog yeah I don't know if White was a waste I don't know what to tell you I don't know what to tell you I don't even like I, I've completely lost the grasp of what this story is really trying to do sometimes so I'm kind of just I just I just be here like I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm in like retrospect retrospect or hindsight mode I kind of just during the week to week slog, I'm just getting ping ponged around. And then when it's all said and done, I could look back and in hindsight try to make sense of all the past events. That's that's kind of where I'm at with Tower God at this point. I don't really try to understand it in the flow of things because it it's hard to. It's so inconsistent. So so yeah. Bam is the underdog. Really makes that arc. Anyways, what was I gonna say? I don't quite. Well, I don't quite. I don't know if you guys were here when I asked this, when when Vince asked this the last time. But we were talking about if we thought that uh, SLU revealed too much about the story too quickly, like in terms of talking about sort of end game stuff. A lot of a lot of really really powerful high ranking characters as early as the first couple of chapters with Enryu creating a life and in the blog post talking about like Eurasia and 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 Yama and Immort and Bay Road and blah 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 and all these things like he and then obviously also wants to make the Tales use a story universe. Right? <clears throat> and Tower God's supposed to be one narrative in that universe. Like you think he was a little over ambitious if he tried to he tried to bite more than he could chew, you know? Yeah. I do think that in hindsight that he, he probably should have just what does thing always say? Um Discovery trumps disclosure. You should have let us just find that out instead of just telling us already. <clears throat> you're, just, you're just along for the ride, and the ride is hella bumpy. The the ride is the ride is a bumpy. The ride the ride has hurt my spine. My my knee hurts. <laughs> I'm in pain. This is just just I don't know what happened to Tower God. It's just like it don't. I'm on, I don't, it doesn't move me the same way you no know, more. I'm like, I'm curious. I'm a, I'm at some point I'm gonna ask people how they feel about like season three as a whole and like how they. have felt in comparison to past arcs but i i expect a lot of cat the bar seems to be really low like how you how you guys read the comment section sometimes like the bar is on the ground these guys will take anything They're like oh god so hype yeah you're going down white i'm like this is what you want you want white to lose all right man after this arc if we used to start bringing in what we hyped in the blog in the blog post yeah it's not gonna happen he was over ambitious likely he lost advantage to 
like order a curry gum i have a plan but wait and see eh, we'll see man we will see yeah curry gum tells you nothing until you find out in the story yeah so that's the best a better approach in my opinion an ordinary season coming soon we hear it's coming back oh do i care <laughs> do i even give a damn i'll re uh, i'll try i'll do my best man the, the, the next two things I want to just kind of get my kick cut up to first is I need to catch back up to hardcore leveling, talk about the second season before Zodiac fucking drop kicks me. Because he's been waiting. I'm sorry, dude. I don't even know you're in the chat, but I'm sorry, dude. It's coming. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm getting through, I'm kind of getting through Purple High Stint, and then I guess I'll do random chatting after that. So, Web do, Webtoons and Manga equals sleep, porn while, porn more raw. I don't know. It's it's true though. Like as a as a whole, webtoons don't move you the same. But m my love for manga has been depleted since like 2016. This is not even new for me. Manga's whatever, man. You know me. I'm on my comic. I read my comics. I watch my Danhua or go or like city calls it my dinghy. I gotta watch my 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 uh, my Chinese animation. My Legend of Hay, my White Snakes, my Scissor Sevens, my 100,000 Bad Jokes. You know, Big Begonia and Fish. I don't know. That's my that's that's my gimmick. That's all I do. So, yeah. Uru Chan greater than SIU. I can't get rid of that. I can't get rid of that right now. The only reason why I can't get rid of that is because that John thing was painful. Jesus Christ, he did. did Jesus Christ, that was painful. I'm not giving her that, but I hear you though. Season seven, season three on Netflix. I I I watched that months ago, bro. <laughs> I watched it months ago. But yeah, I know it's on Netflix now. I, definitely peep that if you haven't seen it. It's really good. I, I'm a, I'm a huge fan of it. Even with the comics, we got to filter out Marvel and DC because they stinky too. That's a fact, bro. That's a fact. Like, I just be on my indie, independent stuff or my, like, webcomic series. Like, you know, romantically apocalyptic and stuff like that. I don't... Nah, bro. I don't know. Whatever whatever DC... Like, you know, like, all that What If stuff from Marvel? Like, people are like, oh, did you watch What If? Like, no, man. I don't give a damn. It's just cooked. Leave me alone. I'm so unmoved by all this. I was done with Endgame. I got closure. I'm good. Iron Man's dead. Whatever, whatever. I moved on. I had nothing else. Nothing else I here wanted to see. I, got, I don't care about WandaVision and none of that. I don't give a damn. When we finna watch Squid Game together? All right. Thank you guys for coming to the stream. I'm about to leave. I'm sick. I think it's wasting my time. Talk about some mid game. Jesus Christ. Come on, dude. <sighs> That's crazy. Scissor 7 is one of my favorite things ever. I'm happy to hear that. I will talk about more Don Juan more, but I don't think anyone gives a damn. I'll be talking about it on Twitter, and people are like, oh, he's watching some shit. I don't care, because it's not like Jujutsu Kaisen, so I don't even be, I don't fight no more. I just, whatever. I'll just watch, my, I watch my thing in peace. But anyways. <sighs> what was I going to say? Yeah, I ain't watching Squid Game, bro. The downfall of John as a character is actually hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> it kind of is. It's a kind of it. Like I don't know, man. I don't give a. I don't dare. Like I just like Arlo and Doctor Dare. So if they're doing shit, someone tell me. If no, no, I don't know, man. I don't give a damn. I just I've lost all care. But I, I don't care no more. It's hard. It's hard to stay. I'm not even interested in Marvel movies these days. Besides the next Spider Man movie coming out, the only thing I care about from really like a superhero movie TV show actually TV shows, I, actually I like Doom Patrol I'll watch Doom Patrol season 3 or whatever if that's coming out I don't know I haven't checked um but like see I like my like my favorite Spider-Man movie ever or property actually is the Into the Spider-Verse movie and I know they're making another one like a sequel to it now I actually expect them to completely royally fuck it up but that's the only thing I'd be excited for nothing else really I don't even like the Batman movie maybe We'll see with um, Robert Patterson. Did I get his name right? I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. You know what's funny? I never read that DC, the DC webtoon thing. I forgot about it. I totally forgot about it. I just thought about that. John stands to get rights anymore. Good. I haven't read an ordinary since the dumbass said I'm gonna I'm gonna be the king. <laughs> you got off when it was good. I don't know, man. I. It's hard to care. Anyways, y'all be safe. I'll be out. This chapter was honestly meh.